What's up, Magnus Sites? I want to talk to you about the alpha male today. Now, I believe there are several types of alpha males. If you look online, though, they'll tell you maybe two or three. I believe there are actually seven types of alpha males. If you look at our society today, there's like seven types of alpha males. And what's funny is I've noticed that if you, I've noticed that certain alpha males either have one or more of these qualities. They're, they're, they're one or more of this set certain type of alpha male. You got what I'm saying? I believe, of course, the ultimate alpha male would probably have uh, the majority of the qualities. Maybe he doesn't need to have all of them, but he can have the majority of these qualities. So what you'll notice is that some qualities will lead into others. Um, one quality of an of, 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 uh, alpha male will allow him to achieve another take up another section of the alpha male. You know what I'm saying? So you understand when I, you know, go through this. All right, first alpha male um, to me, okay, this is my list, is the genius. All right, this is the man with the intellect high above anyone else. This is someone like Albert Einstein or a, a Bill Gates. You got what I'm saying? These guys are just head and shoulders above the rest. They can outthink almost any man out there. Okay, uh, you got someone like Albert Einstein. I mean, come on, theory of relativity. You know, he worked on with that Philadelphia project, and he worked on uh, the nuclear bomb too, right? You know, didn't save it. Yeah, that wasn't exactly a good achievement, but um, it just shows you the amazing things that can be accomplished when you have uh, amazing intellect. You got what I'm saying? Amazing IQ. All right, then guys like guys like Bill Gates use their intellect to build a uh, big business. You got what I'm saying, and that can lead into the wealthy alpha male. Okay, these guys a lot of times they either built it, all right, like building the business from the ground up, and they've just expanded it to the point that it's global and they're just wealthy. And you've got guys that were born into it. A lot of times with wealth comes power. Okay, so the wealthy man, you you know he he's first of all. He's, he's one of the ones that most people usually think of when they think of the alpha, not the genius. They don't think about that. But genius can, a lot of times, can outthink the big businessman, the big, you know, wealthy man. And, you know, in, in, in certain scenarios, she's going to come out way ahead of him. And I think that that's going to, uh, you know, uh, stack him, you know, in front. But the wealthy man, psh, so many things he can do. <laughs> but we already know how much uh, money can get you. You know, wealth will allow you to do anything you want at any point in time that you want to do. You want to fly to Tahiti, stay there for three months, come back. Your business is still running. Your wealth is still going. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, what this? Yeah, you know I mean, the, the 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 wealthy alpha male is is the one that most guys I think seek to achieve to be. The next is the leader. Okay, the leader. Um, is the guy who every, everyone will follow. Uh, he's very charismatic. He's very influential. He, can, he don't have to be rich. And he don't have to be a genius. But he has a way about him. You know, this goes from anyone to Barack Obama, okay, to fucking Charles Manson, to Hitler. You got what I'm saying? These are people that when they speak, people are compelled to follow them. You know what I mean? And um, these are people who, if wealthy, okay, a lot of times uh, if they uh, are intelligent and uh, they use their leadership to build a team, to lead a team, can build a huge corporation. You see where I'm going here? You know what I'm saying? These leaders, a lot of times, are, are also um, the athlete. Okay, athletes are the alpha male. You got what I'm saying? See how I'm spilling into different levels? Okay, so you got the athlete. That's another type. The athlete, a lot of times, um, the athlete is just, he's that all-around, physically superior guy. He can do it all. He can play basketball, football, baseball. He can wrestle. You got what I'm saying? This guy's usually in great shape and... Um, he, he is propelled to new heights with his abilities physically. You got what I'm saying? Oh, what well, are, you know, examples of that? Well, we know what examples of that are. You know, they're the basketball players, the Shaquille O'Neal's, you know what I'm saying? The Michael Jordans, you got what I'm saying? Um, 
that's what I'm talking about. You know, the Lance Armstrongs, you know, the Arnold Schwarzeneggers, the athletes, you know what I'm saying? Whether steroids is used or not, the fact of the matter is these men are looked at as alpha males because of their athletic, you know, ability. Okay. The next one is the ladies' man. Come on, y'all. We all, you know, the, the ladies' man is the good-looking guy that pretty much can get almost any girl he wants at the drop of a dime. You got what I'm saying? This guy has either been pretty from the beginning, he was a cute kid, found out when he got a little older, girls thought he was cute, and he stayed the man for a long time. And he, he may not have, uh, you know, he may not be intelligent, wealthy, you know, he may not be a leader, but he can sure enough pull a woman. What's an example like that? Maybe a possible bad example, but an example is somebody like the situation. You got him. He's 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 a guy who who gets a lot of girls. A lot of people will call him a d bag, but he gets a lot of girls. And his is you notice now he's rich. Okay, so if he makes the right proper decisions, he can grow that into wealth. You see what I'm saying? He used his looks, always flashing his abs, his arrogant attitude. Not all alpha males that are the ladies, man, are arrogant. I know that. What I'm saying is, you see what I'm saying? The next one's the warrior, okay? This is the guy that can fight. He can throw down, okay? He is uh, the Floyd Mayweathers. He is the soldier. You got what I'm saying? He's the bar, the uh, the barroom brawler. He's the tough kid. You got what I'm saying? Uh, he may not have all those other qualities, but he can sure enough fucking fight. And he can punk everybody else on the list because he can fight. But he can also use that to become a ladies' man. He can use that to become wealthy. You see what I'm saying? Uh, and then, um, let's see what else we got here. Uh, to me, one more is the entertainer. Now, the entertainer... Um, is the movie stars, you know, the rock stars, the rap stars, the comedians, you got what I'm saying, the talk show hosts. These are these guys that they may not be smart, they might not be athletes, you got what I'm saying, all these, you know what I'm saying, they may not be a leader, you know, all those other qualities, they may not have them, but they sure enough know how to make people smile, laugh, and keep watching. And with that, yeah, who are they? Oh, well, they're the Brad Pitts. You got what I'm saying? <laughs> they're the Denzel Washingtons. They're the 50 Cents. They're the M&Ms. You got what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? These guys entertain you. You know, the Kevin Hart's. You know what I'm saying? They are entertaining you and, no, and people will pay through the nose to see you do what you do best. And that's entertain. And the fact that you can entertain can help you to build wealth and help you become a ladies man shit all the money you got that you use you can use it to take lessons to become a warrior and to learn how to fight to be an MMA fighter you got what I'm saying stuff like that so I think I, I, think I did catch everybody on the list y'all uh, but yeah to me those are the the the, the, the alpha men that um, that uh, you know exist in our society and who am I who do y'all think I am? Hmm? Am I a combo of a few, or am I one? Or but I would seek to be all of them. You know what I mean? Encompassed in one, because at that level, um, I think you're complete, complete as an alpha male. But that's all I got to say about the subject. Post your comments below. Let me know what you think. Talk to you later.